I apologize for the wind. It's super windy out here. This is LJ from Toro Auto Brokers bringing you a walk around of this 2017 Ford Police Interceptor Utility, also known as the Ford Explorer Police. Um, of course, I always do a circular walk around first and then I go up close and personal um, to highlight any defects I might find. But I have to tell you, this one is extremely, extremely clean. It's a beautiful unit, um, looks to be extremely well taken care of, good miles, paint is beautiful. So let's get to the fender, as you can see, everything's glossy, that's just a piece of pollen, comes right off, um, door looks amazing, one tiny indentation there, and if I back out, you don't even see it. Um, the rest of the unit is absolutely gorgeous. This one is astounding. Tail lights, clear, um, exhaust looks amazing. Even the grab handle for the rear barely has any hand marks. Um, it's all wheel drive, 3.7. Even the appliques. I wish the sun was out so you can see. They're so deep. It's amazing how well taken care of this unit was. Um, let's see. Rear quarter, like I said, mm, looks great. I don't see anything. There's a small smudge there on the rear door that might be able to come off with a polish. But this thing is astounding. Um, passenger door looks great also. Passenger fender. This one is extremely impressive. Even the hood. Anything on the hood is just dust um, from the unit being outside for a few hours, but that's it. Headlights crystal clear. Um, with your Eagle RSA tire up front, that's probably about 60% tread. Um, this rear tire is a Nexon. Um, it's got a lot of tread, maybe 85% tread, maybe 90. Uh, let's check the other tire. This one is also a Nexon, 85, 90% like the other tire. This one is a Nexon. It's maybe about 80%, 70% on the trim. Um, overall, this unit is beautiful. Um, I'm gonna go inside right now. Mileage, um, 92, 233. Climate control unit, AC nice and cold. Also has the laptop stand um all the buttons here for the light bar i think they work Let's see. so i got that to turn on i'm gonna keep playing with a couple more buttons okay, i got more lights to turn on there more lights to turn on there There's a lot of functions. I have not played with it. It's my first time actually playing with the light bar. Um, look, there you go. Now it's got some amber flashing there. Um, so I guess just go through it if you if you want the light bar. Top of the steering wheel looks phenomenal if it would zoom. Tons of texture on the steering wheel. Definitely not a lot of hand action going on there. Seats in great shape. Very nice seat. Has rear door panels. Rear seat looks to have not been used at all. Let's go to the rear hatch area. This one, I assure you, for 92,000 miles, it's very lightly, gently used. 92,000 miles. Also has the backup camera. Rear seats, usually brand new, never used. Like I said, I apologize for the wind. It's so windy today, it's unreal. Passenger seat looks great. Also has the original books and manuals inside the glove, as you can see there. And that's a Troy brand center console unit there. 
light bar brand is there sound signal it can easily be removed if you just like the unit itself as you can see it's very sharp we can remove the light bar it's just a couple of screws and removing the power out of it spotlight does work always fun doing it with one hand on a phone. There you go. Motor idling good. We always leave them running so you can see there's no engine noise or anything like that. I love that push bumper. It's a federal signal brand. I'm not sure if it's going to zoom in there. But it says PBX05. Um, let's close the door and send it off. Any questions, of course, feel free to call or text this LJ Motorola Auto Brokers.